Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2. When last we left off, King Geraint the Bewitched passed on. And now I am King Stephen the Fourth, the potential and future heir to the Byzantine Empire in its entirety. I'm currently dealing with the fact that there is a moderately dangerous faction in my kingdom, but I'm pretty sure I can uh, pacify it with a little bit of gold. I'm also dealing with the fact that uh, there is a certain war happening for my kinsman now, the King of France, when he seems perfectly capable of handling it. I have offered to help, but uh, yeah, he's 85% war score. He's pretty much got this. 90% war score now. And it is over. The King of France has won and remained the King of France. Good. Good indeed. Things have returned relatively to normal. Moray is uh, now independent, and uh, the Count of Ulster fought a very quick war during a rebellion to claim this part of Scotland, which is good. I have two spare vassal limit, that's it, and next to no piety, which is kind of bad. Kind of bad. At this rate, it's going to take me about 7 million years if I conquer this territory to uh, gain any kind of hope of creating a kingdom here. I should invest in technology advancements. I should. Military organization seems like a good idea. However, I could actually improve the strength of my various units. Might be a good idea. Like, for instance, I could improve my heavy infantry. This actually seems like a good idea. And my cavalry. Good plans. Good plans. Uh, I think I actually need to improve the strength of my forces. Because if I'm going to be fighting a lot of wars... I mean, Constantinople is fantastic. Look at that. I will be inheriting a lot of territories. I will probably be giving a lot of them up. But I will be keeping Constantinople purely because it has two cast uh, three castles, three town, three cities, and one... Um, of those. The minor problem of the fact that is... Okay. When did that happen? Normally the Byzantine Empire is Orthodox. The fact that at the moment the Byzantine Empire is Catholic... Is that because... Ah, it's because the Empress is Catholic. And it's obviously spread the influence um, of her faith along the entire empire. Oh, excellent! We have a claim. We are going to use it. Oh, are we going to use it? Sorry, good sir, but um, it's time to war. And I think it's time to call in a few allies. I have uh, been helping a lot of people recently, uh, so I do think that uh, we demand some help in return. We like you more than your enemies. What if I send you some money? You like me enough now? We like you. Oh, my heir. Well, she's probably going to help. What about you? We like you more than your enemies. You are in another war. That is true. Uh, probably won't ask you then. We like you more than your enemies. The King of France would probably really help. If I actually, that's the only person I'm going to call him. Just the King of France. I'm sure you'll say yes. Of course you'll say yes. Look at that army. I need no other armies. At all. To win this war. Look at that. Look at that. Just a mass up into one stack of doom. I can, uh... I can, I can uh, send my boat over there. <laughs> Look at that stack of doom. 13,000 men. I do, however, need to defend against the uh, inevitable attack that is coming my way. I shall educate my uh, daughter for the interim time. Should probably uh, sort that out. And you want to marry this person? Yes, seems fine. So while this doom stack is currently approaching uh, there. Uh, whose levies have I raised too long? You. Oh, your castle levy there. We'll just get rid of this for now. 
because we don't actually need that many more of my levies to uh, deal with this. I don't want to use my own levies, though. Ooh. Crown authority in Ireland might be lowered. <laughs> there are a lot of people that dislike me right now. What if I send you some money? And what if I send you some money? That's not going to work. What if I send you some money? That's not going to work either. I just hope that this war ends quickly. You, however, are uh, levies from my vassals, so you will be fine. And while we're here, why don't we raise some levies here? Okay, it's not many levies, but it's still levies. Raise 11 boats, add them to the pile, and uh, see what these stacks here do. Talk to them about kindness. Marvelous. I don't have enough soldiers here. At all. I cannot unfortunately get you all on this boat. I can, however... I cannot get all of you on this boat. <laughs> I'm telling you this now, you cannot all get on the boat. You guys are going to have to use your own boats. For now, I'm just getting an army ready to crush this uh, army that this king has sent this way. I need enough piety, really. That's what I need. I just need piety. Because once I have this king set up, I will more than capably be able to um, consolidate all of these vassals here into one kingdom. And that will help me. Can I have a duke? For now, however, I shall crush this man's armies. I don't need any more of my, uh... You've discovered a a, uh, a plot where he seeks to claim something. I'd say a clot. You have not discovered a clot, you've discovered a plot. And you're not going to stop. I can imprison you. I'm a little busy right now. But I'm quite sure I can imprison you. Also, this army of yours is failing horrendously, in a stupid manner, and is in fact dead. So, let us just disband these units and, uh, and wait patiently. Also, that plot has just gone. I was just in time. I was just in time to uh, stop him from scheming. They were just about to go ahead when suddenly he was handed a big pile of money from under the table, and he realized he had somewhere else to be, and left. Good. This is the kind of stuff I like to hear. Also, once we've claimed this piece of territory, we can... Uh, how many soldiers are in that? 72! Right, let's go deal with this rabble, shall we? We'll just leave them in Devon for now, I think. How's my retinue anyway? Ah, my uncle's just had a son. Excellent. Yeah, I would say that we've probably won this. I don't think I need to claim any more of these territories as it stands, but I might do so anyway. Those who love will get love in return. You've also found a great philosopher. Of course. I'm not exactly short of cash, am I? Hello, 72 men. Wow. Um... Hmm. I'm relatively young. I'm relatively young. <laughs> but I'm going to need this money soon. Let it go. Let it go, actually. That's ten piety closer to founding a kingdom. And that's important. I want to found another kingdom. Also, why are you not ending your plotting? Lack of power, eh? My aunt is also of legal age. Matrilineally, who can you marry? That is not of my own dynasty. Never mind. Never mind, you guys are staying unmarried. Oh look, another boat's coming! How many men? 52! Let's go get them! They're dead now. Oh, that's just terrible. I'm just letting these guys sort it all out for me. They're sorting it out. They're just going to win this war for me. 
I don't even need to be there. I... Well, whatever was just about to be declared there has immediately gone. They were like, hey, sub... Never mind. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Let's move these soldiers over here, actually. There we go. Your war is pretty much done. What are you guys doing? Are you just sort of joining this stack here? We'll just stay here for now. Seems like a plan. Oh, dangerous faction again. Has someone rejoined it? Or have you just gained a tiny bit more, um... Make you the designated regent. Hmm, I don't like that. Designated regent sounds really bad. Also, we kind of need to kill these people here. Oh, you're moving. Yeah, just... You're not going to get anywhere. We are going to win this war. And when we win this war, I shall start founding this kingdom. I've got to do this all before my mother dies. For when my mother dies... <laughs> this all gets a bit complicated. Don't really have the option of a new unit, do I? Ah, 700 men. I will let you do that for a while, because, in truth, there's no reason not to. Also, we could just assault this. And in fact, we will. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. I mean, this faction has once again uh, gained a small quantity of strength, but uh, nothing we can't handle. Let's assault this, too. Yep, we won that, too. And now we shall go and crush you. Your 800 men. Kapow. 91% war score now. Are you sure you don't want to give up? Nope. Still not feeling it. Okay. We'll wait for this, uh... And then we will just assault this holding as well. Yep. It's safe to say that, uh... No, you're not marrying that person. And secondly... We've won. This territory is now mine. Yes, I know full well that, uh... This, uh... Hang on. Let's just deal with this. Thank you very much, by the way, for coming to help, uh, kinsmen. All retinues will be disbanded. Really? Hmm. I don't want to disband... Th I don't want to disband the rest of you. Ah, because you disband first, and then you get the option of disbanding the retinue. Which, of course, I don't want to do. Right, what can I do? I can create the kingdom. I do not have enough, uh... Piety. I can, however, usurp the duchy. This seems like a good idea. Let us usurp the duchy. So now you are but a count. Two separate counts. And I could just declare war on you guys and start claiming things, but that would just be mean. I'll do it later. What I need to do is assign this territory off to someone. One of my counts, for instance. Is there anybody suitable? My uncle! You actually seem like a good person to have a territory. Why don't I give you this baron... No, oh, this barony. Oh, my son gets that, doesn't he? Actually, I should just hold on to this, then. My son will get a hold of that barony. I'll just hold on to this territory for now. It is good, probably, to have a piece of territory just sticking around. However, I probably don't want to be the duke. I could, however, make you the duke. Would you like to be the duke of this place? Yeah. You quite like me. I'm not shocked. I don't need this chancellor to do anything awesome here anymore, because I could actually just declare war right now and claim this piece of territory. In fact, 
This seems like a great idea. Let us just do that. You are now... I'm now fighting a war with you. You have 500 men. Uh, this war is going to be short. We don't need the boat yet. Just gonna disband that. Yeah, <laughs> there, there goes your army. It's safe to say that there is a good chance that Brittany will soon end up at one of my kingdoms. And I can still righteously imprison you. Good sir, you really need to stop with that um, war of yours. I want to be careful. Pretty soon my uh, mother is not getting any younger. Oh my word, she is bankrupt. Her prestige, however, not bad. You died of the great pox. Smallpox has broken out. This person died of pneumonia. And at the same time, Prince Keith had a daughter. Fair enough. I think this war is pretty much won. Which is handy. I think right now I might want to start using the intrigue to... Uh, buy indulgences? Can I do that? I don't think I can. You used to be able to. Mr. Pope? Um... I can't do that anymore. Oh! But, but I need that piety! I'm gonna have to send this guy over somewhere just so that he can start claim- like, refusing claims. Uh, where do I send him? That's the thing. Where do I send him? So we're small. I could send him to... No, I can't send him to Moray, as he's regained that. Hmm. I could send him over here. To uh, Denmark. Denmark is still tiny, but my word, has Denmark continued to survive? Even to this day, Denmark still endures as a kingdom. By the way, uh, you're next. Hate to break this to you, but you're n also my vassal limit has just go gotten bigger. Either it's gotten bigger, or I've no, it's not gotten bigger. It's that I've put two vassals under this duke. I'm gonna hold on to uh, this piece of territory, though. This piece of territory is going to be mine. Ideally, I probably want that piece of territory, really. It's the biggest piece of the pie. How's the scheming going, guys? Not good, eh? That's a shame. Also, I could still imprison you. You're going to end your plotting, though. That's good. Just end, please. I, I don't want to have to hurt you and kill you. Why can't I do this? I'm not at peace. Oh yeah, I'm not at peace! <laughs> Silly me! Of course I'm not at peace, I'm fighting this war here for this territory. Then I can host a tournament! Excellent. Hello! Blessings upon you. You seek... No... No. This seems like a really bad idea. I mean, you're already married. Like, I'm not marrying anyone over there. I don't want anybody in your massive territory to have power. I mean, sure, these two allied together would be unstoppable. But you could then just turn around and decide you want Wales. And what am I going to be able to do to stop it? The answer is nothing. Also, I only have 104 piety. At this rate, I will actually be able to gain the piety I need to... The problem is, is I think it's this trait. This trait is giving me a minus 0.25 negative um, to my piety. This trait gives me a plus to... Uh, 
plus to my prestige, so it's not the worst trait in the world. Also, what are you actually doing? You're fighting... Ah, you're still fighting an anti-papal war. How's Pope Hilarius doing, by the way? I'm actually curious. <laughs> After all, he is my ally. Where is Pope Hilarius? There you are! You're depressed. But I suppose... I suppose your name does sort of... hint at the fact that, uh... Being the anti-pope is not hilarious at all. Are you going to surrender now? No, you're going to fight to the end, are you? Well, we're going to see this fight out to the end for this video. We'll see it out. And hopefully you won't die anytime soon. You have called... Whoa. Okay. Not good. Not good. End the war quickly. Please. This is bad. This is really bad. Start raising some of my levies. We need to conquer this faster. We need to conquer this so much faster. Portugal is a bad person to be called into this. You have a big army. And I am scared of it. 11,000 men. Bit scared. I know that I know nothing. I also know that I have zero chance of winning this if Portugal managed to get their act together. And Portugal already have their act together. They are bringing boats. Not good. Not good at all. Oh, this could be complicated. This is going to get very bad very quickly. Quick! Send soldiers! Um... Help! I know you're in a war. I know. But please help. <laughs> please help before they send more people! Thank you. Yes, I know. I'm calling on you again. I'm terrible. Who's gonna educate? Uh, you again! Gaston! Prince Gaston of France. Awesome. Both your wives are dead. Were you murdered? You were in fact murdered. Okay. It would seem like Portugal don't have enough actual power to oppose me. I'm sorry for calling you guys in, but I wanted to be sure of this. Help! They do have a big army. They do have a big army. I don't want to be... Okay, that was a bit of overkill. I thought you guys might go and deal with that, but we've won. Oh, that was a relief. Oh, that's a relief. Oh man, what a relief. When we come back, folks, how about a tournament to cheer ourselves up? Maybe we won't die. <laughs> of course we're going to die, aren't we? I'll catch you next time, and I'll see you then. Later.